What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Chaos Loud 9 and I'm coming in with a new Warframe video, and today, in this Warframe video, we're going to do some Kuva farming. Kuva is a type of material that you can use to reroll ribbon mods, or you can use them to craft new weapons. Kuva isn't accessible to any players unless you go through the story mode which is over here in your codec you have to work your way down all the way to here after the second dream to the war within where you start fighting the queens I'm not gonna t talk too much about the story mode so you guys can go and play it yourself so you won't be spoiled of anything And today I'm starring uh, a new Warframe. His name is Naza. He's a tank Warframe too, but I think he's like one of the lower tier Warframes in tanking. I think. Um, I think Nidus is a is the most popular tanker. Nidus, Rhino, or um. Yeah, I think it's Nidus. He's a very good tanker. Him and Enaros are pretty good tankers. But Kuva farming is pretty easy. What you have to do is you have to go into the mission and search out the Kuva siphon. And what you have to do is you have to break his, ten his uh, tentacles that absorb the kuva that's floating up in the air. You'll see them flying across the map. There'll be like a black cloud with red particles, red dot particles. And you have to go into a... Uh... My bad, that was my phone. You have to go into a uh, tenno... Uh, what is it? I want to say you have to transfer, do transference into your Tenno. Grenier prey on the weak, but we, we prey on the Grenier. And you have to do a void dash in order to collect the Kuva. Now I didn't even activate that ability. Well, I might have did on accident. That's called Firewalker. It's a continuous uh, ability. When you use it, when you run, you create a trail of fire. Scans indicate our target is in the vicinity. Find them. And I'm probably gonna get raped because I don't have any to use my uh, warding halo, which uh, gives me vulnerability. It's like more armor with nasal, which I'm gonna I'm gonna maybe use it. Bring them in. Oh, the target disappeared. Oh, they should be. And they're down. Yeah, this is our ca capture mission, Coach. You have to just mission go to the complete. mission. The captive has been escorted to the extraction plant. And just capture well them. You are surrounded by Grenier Marines. Now, I may have captured them, but it's a Kuva siphon on this now, so I have to search it out.
it look like it's trying to be hard for me to find. It might have to be it might be down deeper. Wow, like, what the freak? It's not here, what? I'm detecting a large security force heading your way. It's the Grenier. I'm not worried about the Grenier right now. I'm trying to look for this Kuva cycle. That they're making so unbelievably hard to find. I even have the map up and I still don't find, I haven't saw it yet. What? Makubro's dead. I mean, not Makubro, my Kavak. I'm using a new pet. Trying to look for this Google siphon and my pit just died. I let my pit die. But I think I found where I'm supposed to go. Nope, never mind. Okay, hold on. Dude. <laughs> Where is this siphon at?
Well, that's fine. It's more. It's more than one Kuva mission that pops up around the map. Or the navigation map. I don't know, for some reason I couldn't find the Kuva Siphon. Probably because I already uh captured the dude before I found the Kuva Siphon. I don't know. It usually doesn't do that. But sometimes a game has its problems, you know. We're probably going to get one of these crossfire. Oh, yeah. Um, the new pet that I'm using, it's a Kavat. It's like a, a cat. Um, you have to scan these in the Orc and Derelict. These appearing uh, do the sands of Inaro's quest you know what to do that's how with uh nasa you can also if you have the uh safeguard you can use uh warding halo on your allies and yourself Just ability I still he has a lot more skirmish. Doors are locked. Time to break in. Override complete. Move on. Alarms successfully hacked. The location is returning to normal security levels. Relax, child. You won't feel a thing. <laughs> oh my God! They are doing me so wrong right now. Look! Oh my God! The resonance frequency has changed. You are onto something, Tenno. Reads. 
This is the Kuva Siphon. And it's got four braids on it. I just broke one off. And the thing that I just uh picked up out of arrows was what I was talking about That's earlier. Moved on. It's safe to proceed. My little rumble dimples. Why must you let them hurt my siphon? Do you want me to get mean? Um, no weapons, no type of weapons will be able to damage it. That worked. Target so catching that cloud, that Kuva cloud or energy, is the best way of destroying the uh, Kuva siphon. So don't waste your time just shooting at it. And don't worry, you have those diamonds. If the diamonds fill up all the way, then the Kuva Siphon will disappear. But you have to be able to break for those braids before all of those diamonds fill up. If you think she looks ugly, just look and see what her sister looks like. Let's get going. She is even uglier. Yeah, that's basically what a uh Kuva farming is. Um, some of them are way harder. Like that one is a level one. A pretty easy uh Kuva uh si Kuva farming mission. The ones with like the three Kuva tiers on them, or the more high ones, level eighty to one hundred. So they're a lot harder, and they give you more Kuva. That move that I just used was the one I talked about earlier, Firewalker. It's a move you can shut on and shut off because it continu it'll continuously uh, stay active when you activate it. Naza is also built around duration and strength. Just putting that out there if any of you want to use Naza. In order to get her parts, you can get them from the dojo in a clan. You have to join the clan in order to uh, join the dojo.
broken their ranks and they are on the run. Another successful mission. Fine extraction. And there we go. 615 Kuba. I think I'm gonna do one more. But yeah, Naze is a pretty fun Warframe. Um, I don't really use him for like real tough missions. He's just like a kind of fun Warframe. That I think if he's built right, he might, um, or he's get some kind of buff. Yeah, Kuva missions can pop up anywhere. to find the VIP and take them down. Do not let the target escape. The Grenier used to be builders, but now all they make is war. Captain War has led under suspicion of possessing a Roken technology that grants him powerful abilities. We cannot allow this. Get to his location and eliminate him. He will be the first boss in this game. When you first start put oh wow, I just killed myself. This ship is crawling with grunts. Getting to Vora will prove difficult. You've been seen. I see you. Vor has a tendency to play with his prey. Do not let yourself become distracted. Wow. They put the Kuva siphon right here with him. What the? You see how they're doing me? What is that thing? Relax, child. You won't feel a thing. <laughs> I promise. Yeah, those are those annoying guardians. You've located the VIP. Time to go to work. Kuva guardian. You will join us one way or another. Well, it's stuck on the fence. I hear you. What a waste. And yeah, it's best. You have to knock your armor off. You have to go into your tenor mode. And you have to, uh do a void blast and then you have to dash at them. <laughs> Straight through the grenier. 
And then you have to immediately shoot them or their armor will come back. Oh wow, I just dusted him. I guess he's talking about eating me since he's talking about my guts will serve him well. Down. Assassination contract complete. Great work, Tenno. All right. I think I'm gonna show you guys a little treat. Um, since I've done Sakuba farming, um, I have some ribbon moss that I need to roll. Um, let's go and see what kind of roll I get. These are currently all of my ribbon mods. Some of them I haven't rolled over five times. Some of them I have. Um, the one I was thinking about rolling was my crow core, but it's kind of hard looking at all these now. Now. I'm not even going to touch my Cyberus Gelicron because I've rolled that thing 11 times and I think it's pretty decent because of the critical chance. I don't too much like the minus static status chance though. Um, if you guys look out, check out the video and see any river mod that you guys want. Now I'm just telling you, my Dread, my Boltus, my Boar, my Dark Split Sword. My side bears, Latron, Lakira, Crocor, Dual Cleavers, and Lakor. Cosmic background radiation is arrived. And Dual Raza River Mines are pretty much off limits. I'm just being honest right now. And up front with you guys, cause I love those. And I'm gonna try to put some effort into those, into those ribbons. So let's see what kind of roll I get on my uh, crow core. When you roll a ribbon mod, you roll it. And you see what kind of stats you get on it. Now. This was my last, my last roll. This is my new one. And boy, does it look amazing. Now, the Crocor is a slash damage weapon and it does status. The critical damage is good. The channeling, channeling, ch channeling damage is good now if I want to put something into channeling I may do that but I don't think the minus slash damage 
is going to do anything because, like, what minus damage to invest infested because slash damage is very vulnerable to um, infected enemies. So, I don't think I'm going to stick with this role. Or I may roll it again, which I'm going to do. I'm going to roll it again. Now, this isn't a good roll. When you get a bad roll, you can just go back over and confirm the previous roll. And you'll keep the, the roll that you had previously from that. So this is my new role for my crow core weapon that I'm gonna make a uh, setup for for whenever I finish leveling it up. So yeah, I appreciate you guys watching this video, being part of this new Warframe video with me. And whenever I get finished leveling up my crow core, I'm gonna be making a a build for it for you guys and yeah when my next warframe video come up be ready thank you guys for watching peace